Hello, how are you? Bob, Jeff in Las Vegas. Good morning. Good. Good morning. How's it going? It's going great, man. Such a thrill to talk to you. First oh, time. Thank you. Yeah, it is. It's weird. I th you think I would have with all my appearances in Vegas. So, I don't know. Well, I'm a native. I'm a native, so this is a thrill for me. I like that. That's that's nice. I, I always play. Sometimes I'll go. I played the Book of Bowl a couple times because it's off the path. And it's not like you're gambling. It's like you're going to see a show, which I liked. Excellent. Well, we'd love having you here. Thank you. Well, you know, Bob, rumor has it that Nashville Squares is a tic-tac-toe tapping good time. Is that true? That <laughs> is true. That's what they wrote. That's what I'll say. Um, it's interesting. I, I had years ago, I'd been offered Hollywood Squares as a host, but then Tom Bergeron did an amazing job, and I was doing other stuff. And then this thing came along out of nowhere just months before. And they said, do you want to do this? And I said, why me? And then they said, well, you, you are country, kind of. And a lot of my, I even got Grammy nominated for one of my specials that had a couple country songs in it. And I just love country. I love all music, all music, hip hop, rock and roll, every country folk. Uh, but this thing has Tanya Tucker in the center square, you know, legends, you know. Marie Osmond was there. Gary Busey's up there going, huh? So you got to talk to him. And a lot of really good comedian people, too. Uh, Bill Ingvald, who I love. Caroline Ray, Fortune Feimster, Lonnie Love, and a lot of music stars. And that's what the show's about. But it's really just free form, no script. The, read the copy when it comes to a prize or a question. But otherwise, it's just ad-lib fun. And I took the job because it, it just made all the sense in the world. And I got other things coming out. The, the, the Dirty Video Show comes out. Not dirty, but whatever. A more adult next year. And I got Fuller House is winding down our last season. So we run nine this end of this year and the beginning of next year. And I'm out touring doing stand-up. So I'll come back to Vegas. But, uh, but Nashville Squares runs tonight at 8 p.m. on CMT. And then uh, Friday nights after that uh, on CMT at 8 o'clock, my old TGIF spot for full house <laughs> and and this is an exclusive club because you're now an official game show host i mean you don't realize what kind of company you're in well no i've done it a million times i did one versus 100 which was a big one on nbc but then game shows went off the air so it was deal or no deal and uh and my show one versus 100 which was a hit and then a uh, millionaire they all went off the air out of prime time because they said game shows are over well guess what we're looking at you know here I go guesting on Anthony Anderson's To Tell the Truth and Alec Baldwin's Match Game. And this is my, it's one of the things I do, you know. I'm, I'm acting in a bunch of stuff. I've got literally a, a ton of things I'm working on. I'm directing three things. So uh, traffic, I direct traffic. But, uh, and I work in a deli. But, uh, but I, I just <laughs> love doing many different things. And this is like just something that's one of the things I do. You know, it's one of the six things that I do, and I love doing it. I love stand-up. That's kind of at the, the top because that's sometimes. Directing is too. But stand-up, you get to make those people happy. They're watching the news all day. Same with a show like Nashville Squares. You, you get to not think about any of that. You get to just have fun. And we're supposed to be having some of that while we live our lives rather than getting yeah. all upset. So uh, I'm, I'm thrilled about it. I'm really happy. And CMT's really behind it, which is great. You know, it's, it's funny, Bob, because I always had a, uh, an opinion of you, basically, you know, over my life, like from Full House, you know, what kind of uh, com comedian you were, you know. And it, until I saw you in The Aristocrats, then I totally had my, my attitude towards you changed and became a super fan. Well, that's very nice. And that movie can't be released now because of the way the, the world has changed. Uh, but it's a piece of art. George Carlin said it at the beginning. This is not a joke for public consumption. This is to be told in an alley to another friend. Um, and, and it's an art. The, the movie is about freedom of speech. And that's what I think a lot of the great comedians, I mean, Dave Chappelle just got the Mark Twain Prize the other night at the Kennedy Center. I was supposed to be there last night, but I couldn't because I had to be here in L.A. to uh, actually evacuate my house, which is always fun. But um, it's just, not, you know, it's all, we're, we're all here to, to do something good, um, I mean, you're entertaining people. You're, you're, you know, you, you, you do what you do, and you can talk about the world or politics, or you can not. 
and I choose right now most of the stuff I'm doing is to entertain people and just make them feel good, you know, and then be funny. I got to be funny and I've got to make a point to what I'm doing. It has to be somewhat eloquent, even though I got a really bad SAT score. <laughs> well, you know, Bob, you're an amazing person, author, musician, comedian, actor, director. What's left to do? I mean, what's the challenge? I, I heard I didn't hear the last part of that. I heard a challenge. <laughs> well, I, well, I'm just saying, author, musician, comedian, actor, director. I mean, what's next for you? I mean, well, what, to is live there up more challenge to live up to those things. That's well, I really want to make a couple great movies, and I feel like I made one or two, but I, I really want to make something really great that travels the world that people love. Uh, same with the stand up special, uh, something that really hits people uh, and goes around the world. I, I want to, I played London, I played Australia, but I haven't gone and traveled like some of my friends that I look up to, like Bill Burr, a few people that just go and hit the entire world. There's something very fun about that, because if you're gonna, I just did four stand-up dates on the East Coast, and it was it was hard. It was, um, you know, you're on the road, and, and there were theater dates, and now I'm gonna do some clubs and work out the new material. So I think everything I do is a challenge. Broadway has been one of my favorite things. I was in the last play I was in, I played a Lutheran minister in Hand to God, and I wasn't the funny one, and people didn't know it was me. I was a Lutheran minister, and I've been on Broadway a couple times. I love acting, but I love directing, too. I have a movie, Benjamin, on Hulu right now. Um, so I, I'm a mixed bag. I'm just trying. To, I think maybe if I didn't try so many things all the time and just concentrate just on one thing, but I do when I'm doing it. So right now I'm Nashville Squares man. You know, <laughs> just, <laughs> hey, it's Nashville well, Squares, Friday nights on well, CMT. All right, congratulations on Nashville Squares on CMT on Friday night. And, hey, come out to Vegas because I'm dying to watch you out here. And we got Jimmy Kimmel's Comedy Club. we got so many things out here we'd love to yeah, have. Yeah, I'll play, I'll play one of the, the, you know, one of the casinos or something. Or, or something, you know, something fun. I've played a lot of different venues there, but I'll, I'll do that. Yeah, I don't. I love Jimmy Kimmel so much, but I don't play comedy clubs like in Vegas and stuff. I, I just I'll visit. I'll go and do a set, but I but I like to do it. You know, you know, I got I got I got a little bit of an ego, so I you know, and I could pack a house, so I'll I'll pack a house, and 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 awesome. but I'll invite you to it. That'll be nice because you're so kind. So you're in. Well, you bet. You bet, Bob. I can't wait, all right? So uh, Thank congratulations you. on all your efforts. Thanks so much. I appreciate it very much. All right. Take care. Bye-bye. Thank you.